Hey guys, enjoying our reaction videos? If you are, please click the link to the reacted video in the description and show the creator lots of support. Thanks guys. I am not an animal. I am a human being. Alright, that's kind of an animal too. Who knows what that's from? Who can re who would actually do you know what that's from? I am not an animal. I am a human being. Sounds like something from Monty Python. Oh please. <laughs> I, well, I am an animal. Okay, let's get that free and clear. I, the Hunchback of Notre Dame says that. Uh -huh. We're noticing, um, and I don't know if you're going to be able to see this, because uh, sometimes our our um, camera monitor shows the lighting a bit differently than the finished product. It looks like, which I, this eye looks like it's got this red, like, little spot of, of period blood or something right next to my eye. But when I get close to the camera, it goes away. I just got close now to the camera and every bit went away. Ah! Oh, that was disgusting. Oh, I would have rather had the period blood. It would have been less disgusting. Just saying. Yeah. We're watching Brandon Rogers today, so you know we're happy. And I want you guys to make sure. This one is Kids TV Host Meltdown. It's the latest one he put on his channel. Make sure. Even if you've already seen this video, make sure you go um, back to his... <laughs> to the... Uh, Page for Kids TV Host Meltdown. I have the link right in the description, as I always do. It's the first link in the description, whatever video we react to. And going in the um, description, he's got the links where you can follow along for his TV show. Everything he needs you to do, follow him on Facebook. Follow the site he gives you there, because we got to support the shit out of him. TV is rough, and, and sometimes they don't have a lot of, uh, of patience in the TV world. So we got to make sure he's hitting it big right from the start. So make sure you're supporting the crap out of him. Because he's not an animal. He's a human being. And me, I've got period blood in my eye. You guys have the video? Do we want to talk about period blood more? No. No one does. Oh! Except for people who... No, 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 no. Now, was that true? Didn't some of you still want to have this conversation? Let me know. Yeah, yeah. So I thought, I, I, I can see them. They're all, they're all screw spads, kid. Of course we did. Good morning, boys Holy and shit. girls. I hope you're all hungry. I'm starving. Starving for pizza? Because that's what we're going to make. Mmm, delicious. Let's get started. Oh, all you need he's creeped out in this one. I like it. Some tomato paste and some shredded cheese. <laughs> Between and their text here. <laughs> Step one, take the Between tomato paste. Is and acting. Shove it up your ass. What the fuck's the line? Someone please give me a sandwich. That is costume. You fuck your cross eyed daughter. Can't get it fucking right. This is your grocery list. Certainly explains why you're a fat piece of shit. Is this wow! blood? I keep that hits goes home. I'm a fat I'm piece sorry, of shit. You guys. Yeah, yeah, shit. Black. Big it. black dicks. What? <laughs> cock, cock, cock. Shit. Cock. This is. I love that we're doing a cooking segment for an age bracket that can't wipe their own ass. Can you get a trash can, please? Fuck it. I can't wipe my own ass. Someone, please give me some fucking water. Thank you for the concussion. Where's my therapy ball? When were you going to tell me we had more of these? Fucking get it right. Do you have any more cheese? Yep, saw that coming. On this episode, we're going to have a roach problem. Children's television. A vessel that transports young This is a show, you guys. Good morning, boys and girls. Hi, Mr. Marble. I know you eat better when nobody's watching. It's March when you bitch. I put everything in that show, and I'm not gonna let some piece of shit production assistant ruin it for me. Arlo, the kids have been waiting for autographs. And they shall receive one. <laughs> <laughs> Man, it's fun of, I can't fucking wait. It's also a good show. Oh, you guys, come on. Hashtag magic, you magic fun. Hat. You guys gotta support the shit out of this. Oh my god. <laughs> yep, saw that one coming. <laughs> <laughs> yep, saw that one coming. <laughs> and, the, and his, I mean, even when he, now, this video obviously is not a trailer, but promotion for the series. Yeah. And even at that, it's a promotional video for the series, and it's funnier than anything else you can watch on fucking YouTube. Yeah. Guy is fucking hysterical. <laughs> okay, we're we're gonna rewatch that. Do we rewatch it right now? No, yeah. no, we don't. We don't yeah, need to put it up twice. We're gonna rewatch it as soon as we stop. Oh yeah. This guy is so. I I, I love Brandon Rogers. Guys, make sure, like I say, make sure you're supporting the shit out of him. And remember that I'm not an animal. I'm a human being. 
Are Have I ever guy? told them the uh, um, Hunchback of Notre Dame joke? I don't think you have. Wait a second. All right. I've got a joke about the Hunchback of Notre Dame. Now we're going to find out who really is A, either a fan of the channel, or B, has absolutely nothing fucking else to do. Cause I, should I tell him the joke? Yeah, sure. Let's go. The, okay, okay. Here it comes. Here it comes. And don't forget, go support Brandon. All right. <clears throat> It seems finally, Quasimodo, the hunchback of Notre Dame, he's finally talked, what was her name? Esmeralda, I think his girlfriend was, into marrying him. So now he's going to be on his honeymoon, so he's going to need somebody to substitute in for him, ringing the bell at Notre Dame. So he puts an ad in the local paper or stone tablet or whatever they had back in that period, and he gets an applicant to come by, and uh, he wants to do the job for the week that he's gone, so... Quasimodo says, all right, well, it's really quite simple. Follow me up here. And they go way up the stairs, up into the bell tower. And Quasimodo says, very simple indeed. All you do is you get behind the bell like this, and you give it a big push. Step aside. It goes bing, bong, bing, bong. That's it. That's all there is to it. He's, and so the, the trainee is like, oh. And Quasimodo says, you think you have it? The trainee says, yeah, I think so. He says, well, give it a try, young man. So the guy goes in, gets behind the bell, gives it a big push, completely forgets to move out of the way. The bell comes back, whacks him, knocks him all the way out of the tower, drops the 20 or so stories all the way down to the ground, splat. Quasimodo's like, oh, that didn't work out as well as I might have hoped. Now I still need someone. And so he starts making his way down the bell tower. By the time he gets to the bottom, uh, there's a big crowd of people around the mess that used to be the trainee guy. And the uh, local authorities are there. And so the local constable... Looks at Quasimodo. Or looks, at, looks at Quasimodo, and he goes, "Quasimodo," he says, "Do you know this guy?" And Quasimodo says, "Well, I don't know his name, but his face rings a bell." Mm. You fucking stayed for that. <laughs> you stayed. For, okay, wait, 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 wait. Now we're gonna find out which of you are really, really fucked up. There's a second part to this joke. You can't possibly still be watching this video. I don't believe anybody's still watching. Oh, and I can't even be as disturbing as that. There's, <laughs> there's a second part to this joke. So Quasimodo still, he still needs somebody to ring the bell at Notre Dame. So he puts the ad back in. He gets another, another one, <laughs> another person to come by and check it out. And isn't it the first fucking guy's twin brother? So Quasimodo's like, well, maybe they didn't. Uh, they, they didn't get the same brain genetics. Maybe this will work out. So they go all the way up to the top of the bell tower. They get up there. Quasimodo says, very simple indeed. He gives the bell a big push. You step to the side. Important detail. Bing, bong, bing, bong. You've done it. He says, you ready to give it a try? The twin brother trainee says, yeah, I think I got it. Gives it a big push. Never moves out of the way. Bell hits him. Whack. Knocks him out of the tower. All the way down. Splat the whole nine. Quasimodo's like, son of a bitch. He says, I, I don't even think I'm going to get married. And he starts going all the way down the stairs. Gets to the bottom. Big crowd around again. Another splatter spot. The, the authorities are there. And this time the constable looks at Quasimodo and he says, Quasimodo. He says, do you know this guy? And Quasimodo says, well, I don't know his name. Hmm. But he's a dead ringer for the other one. <laughs> dead ringer! <laughs> he's, his, he's his twin! <laughs> and ring! The bell rings! And a... <laughs> dead ringer! His face rings a bell! I fucking won't! Why are you guys still here? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go watch Brandon Rogers again, because that was actually funny. Ah, that was random.